Hello guys, what is up? Today we're going to take a look at the new Tavern Brawl. Which seems that all you have to do is... Take three cards, and that would be your deck. Alright, this would be interesting. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna take Mage, I believe. And what we wanna do, I think we're gonna try out this new card. Prince Malkashar. I wonder if... If you play him, does that mean I get 5 extra legendary minions to your deck? Does that mean, does that count for all 10 of them that they do it? So I would get 50 extra legendary cards? That would be pretty fun. Other than that, I think we want to go with one of our favorite cards, of course. The Unstable Portal. And the last card will probably be either Arcane Intellect or Duplicate. Maybe we add some... Because we do need card draw. What if we add that one drop? No, he's a two drop, isn't he? It's a two drop we could use. No, you know what? We're gonna go with Arcane Intellect. Because if we have the card draw, then we can just keep on shuffling in legendaries into our hand and whatnot. So let's try this out. Seems interesting enough. Hopefully we do get the 50 extra legendary cards, which will, which will make this a lot more interesting. Alright, so we're gonna toss all these cards, because these are not the cards we want. Preferably we get unstable portals in our starting hand. Perfect. Why didn't I take my golden unstable portal? Hmm. Oh well. Shouldn't be too... Too bad anyways. Ooh. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Man, that's that's hilarious. Holy moly. Nice. That's fun. That's really fun. Oh, Raven Idol. That's a good card for this. Sky Captain Crag. What? 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 That was. That doesn't count. First of all, let's go back in here and we're gonna undo the wrong with it. We're gonna have the golden unstable portal. Unfortunately, we do not have Golden Prince Malkashar. Oh, wait, 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 no, maybe I can craft him in Golden. I should have enough dust to craft him in Golden, that would be so good. Victory or death, I wonder what this warrior will play. Two unstable portals, arcane intellect, that's good. Fifty-nine. Oh, that's hilarious. Armor Smith. Huh. King of the Okay. I mean, that ain't bad. In the ring. Oh, shit. Oof. That's strong, nonetheless. We don't really have a decent counter for this, but we're gonna play the. 
this guy. So the tree coach he has his those buffs and is he gonna do Does he really have four of them? Wow, okay, well That's not good. What is my thing is uh Right now we're struggling a bit against this madness. Nothing scares me. I can give him that extra armor. Now, if he got another rampage, I'm probably in a really tight spot here. That's just very strong, holy shit. Like, turn 166. Or turn two was it? Turn two maybe. Um, we can't play Mukla because then we'll get uh, two bananas. I guess what we have to do is arcane intellect here and pray for the pray for the best. Light spawn. We're most likely in danger here. Might as well be GG straight away. Because we do not have any form of sustain in this stick. Oh man. Um, well, Arcane Intellect. I'm in a mistake. Well played. That was a fast loss. Taking its sweet time. Go ahead. Well played. That was a really, really interesting deck to face. I'm not sure if we want to keep the. Maybe Arcane Intellect was a bad idea. Maybe we can get something else that's a bit better. So let's see if we can switch that out for something. Arcane Intellect, we can change that one for a... What can we do? Or what should we put as well? Should we have face a summoner maybe? No. Let's see. Wait, hold on. What if we can do it this way? What is that card that replaces all your... This one, Renounced Darkness. Replace your hero power and world card with another. So basically what we can do, we can just put in random warlock cards and then we'll exchange all of them for some other spell to random cards. That could be interesting. Maybe we should have something we can actually make use of. What if we just add soul fire and power over what now? Possessed villager. Done. Now, if we just get that, well, it's a 30% chance, 33% chance that we'll get that card. I like the idea but have, of having Prince Malkashar. But I think the problem with that deck will be if you build it completely stupid RNG like I did, it will probably not be too good. Okay, there we have Renounced Darkness. Perfect. And we'll turn one, unfortunately. If we were turn two, we could coin Renounce Darkness, but. I greet you. What will he play turn one? Ooh, what's that card pack? Card back. It's pretty. 
I like it. Alright, let's renounce darkness. See what we get. Okay, so now we're a druid warlock. We have mounted raptors. That's pretty cool. Druid of the Fang. That's pretty cool as well. Coin a tree drop. Frost. Oh, it's. It's a frost mage. With ice lance and gun as well. Oh. That will hurt. Mounted Raptor. If it doesn't kill Mounted Raptor, then we can. The Druid. Is he just gonna toss Frost Bolts and Ice Lances on my face until I die? Probably. Snakes. It has. Let's pay him back with some damage next turn. Let's see if he still goes face. He can frost bolt and two ice lances. That's six, nine damage, right? Oh, it's four. Oh, oh boy. Oh, okay, well. Take a walk on the wild side. I might be doomed already. <sighs> Secret? Is it ice block then? I think it's ice block. Alright, we could use star fire what we want to. Yeah, it has to be ice block then. Ice block. Let's see if we can cough up 10 damage here. So if he gets another ice lance, I'm doomed. Yeah. Oh man. That's some way to play. <laughs> I like this deck idea though. Know, with getting a random deck, like, to do that thing. I, I, I think I'm gonna try this one more time with this deck and then we can try out something else because I'm gonna see what else you can do with this it's interesting I like it versus Jaina. okay this is not what I want I don't want these cards I want to have my there we have it renounced darkness I mean, we can play a Possessed Villager turn one. Get it out. Get it out. I greet you. I greet you. Oh, that's also a pretty card back. Man, oh, I can already tell this will be bad. Oh, no. Oh, boy. So I'm a mage now. Blast. Oh, jolly. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What? <laughs> That's also a way to play. Hello. Hello to you, too. Oh, we're gonna. So we will just keep on tossing spells, I guess. Another arcane missile, yeah. Might have to polymorph next turn. On one of his dudes. Since I got a mage deck, maybe a frost nova here would be ideal. So he most likely already won, we're gonna concede. These decks they make are... I wouldn't say fun, 
but they're sure making use of it. Let's actually try to think of something else. What if we go druid? We go with we go with innervate. I I know this might sound like a stupid idea to go with innervate. We'll go innervate, raven idol, and we'll go prince malkishar. Oh, that's right. Uh, crafting. Can we craft him in gold? I think we'll we'll do it. All realities, all dimensions are to me. Perfect. That's just great. Look at that beauty. That's just. Mm -mm -mm. Wonderful. That's great. And I'm being spammed on Skype quite a bit. And my dog is here as well. Alright, we can toss Prince Malkashar, both of them, because you don't really need them in your starter hand. Okay, so we got innervates and coins. So, if we get a nice legendary now, that would be sweet, because then we do have the possibility of tossing out the uh, big guy. Of course we got Prince Malkasha, so this might be the same thing again. Let's see, discover a minion. It's just a friend of beast con. Calling a dragon. Uh, these are some pretty bad cards in this situation, to be honest. I mean, we could do this guy I don't have enough maps. and hope that we get a legendary dragon next turn. Mirror image this time. I mean, that's pretty, pretty smart. Goblin Mechator. Now we're talking really bad legendary cards. But you know what? Just for the sake of randomness. We're just gonna keep on buffing his cards, are we not? <laughs> this card must be the most useless legendary card out there. Hands down, it has to be. If you guys know of a worse legendary card than this one, I'd like to know. Like, I'm curious to see. Shilmo? We don't have a dragon though, but we can play this little fella. Please don't buff one of his creatures again. Thank you. The reason why I didn't drop Chilmo is if I get a dragon next turn, I, I might be able to turn this game around. But that would require me to get a dragon. Alright, so we're going to discover a minion. Hopefully it will be... Or we discover a spell and hope that it will be... No, we can't flame strike. That's not possible. We could... Maybe we'll get a heal or something. Restore 6 HP. Yeah, that could work. Not that I think I'll live, but... Potential. 12, no, it's not potential. Not potential at all. Okay, we're gonna... I can see. This didn't turn out quite the way we wanted it. We're gonna play one last time in this adventure. See if we can actually get a real win. With a stupid deck like this. Let's see how that turns out. If we find ourselves an opponent, that is. 
There we go. Malfurion versus Malfurion. Once again, we will toss the Prince Malkishar. Hope that we actually get the good legendary this time. The legions I command. Natural mistake. Spectacular. What does he have up his sleeve? So he is also playing with Innerate. Oh, I see. One of those kind of people. We're gonna do the double inner rate here. Together with coin, and then we're gonna play the skeleton knight. You win or you die. You win or you die. So he's got a mill deck. I do have 57 cards in my deck. So, naturalize, of course. Get two cards in my hand. Not again. Oh boy, this will be interesting. Question mark. We're gonna Raven Island, we're gonna discover a spell. Right. And we're gonna discover another spell. Bone Blade Portal. We're gonna use all these things, of course. We'll play this weird ass goblin mecha torch. Oh god, no. Not the homing chicken. <laughs> oh man. I just helped him mill my deck. At the end of your turn, put the minion from the deck into the battle. Oof. But he does have naturalized though. So I mean... <laughs> oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. Well, shit. I'm gonna be milled the shit out. <laughs> My greetings. <sighs> what do you have this time? More cold light oracles. I do know that. We don't have any dragons in the that's unfortunate. My hand is too Not bagel, that doesn't really matter. It's gonna play more. More cold lights. Oh, shit. That's right, he can do it that way. Oh, 
Oh man, that's great. That's healer's alpha. I'll take some of that. So he's got 7 cards, I got 26 cards. I guess he's just gonna mill the shit out of me. All this golden legendary is going to waste. Not the naturalize. My hand is too full. Right, so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna discover a spell here. I guess we could go Mark of the Wild, even though we'll probably just go ahead and clear. Which Murloc on the battlefield? At least all Murkai will be pretty strong here. A natural mistake. A natural mistake. Well played. Well played. A natural mistake. Can he outmill me already? Or will he just outmill himself? I don't know actually. My hand is too full. Okay. Hmm. Huh. What's the best way of dealing with this? He probably has naturalize, of course. So I guess if we play this one, he has 5, he has 10, 11 damage. So if we play this, there's no more cards. He probably only have naturalize left. Still have 14 cards. My hand is born stayed. Unfortunate. I do have 5 HP left. He probably has a bunch of naturalized still, so I'm probably bone no matter how I tackle this. But I guess we can play this guy with a tone. He probably got me by now with naturalize. He probably did. Yeah. He had two inner and of course he had one naturalize left. Yeah. Unfortunate. But. Oh man, if I could have gotten my Baron Garden earlier. Put him in GG. This is interesting though. I like this. You know what? I will probably play one more. all this actually hope that we get yeah inner rates so potential legendary cards greetings what would this guy be playing that's my question <laughs> Murlox. oh my god that's if I add two bananas to your hand, that's pretty cool. I guess we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna... Spy, five, five. 
five six. We we'll take the five six. Number Tori, Raven Idol, Discover Spell. No rush. A pretty solid start. I don't know what the rest of his Murlocs are though. Like, did you guys see that? That the skull was on Malkasha? That's weird. He's just gonna keep on dishing out Murlocs and punch me in the face. <laughs> oh, that's pretty fun. I like Murlocs. They're cool. Right, so we're going to make the most use of our hero of Malkasha. So maybe this time he's forced to clear him with the hero power, but we'll see how that ends. Charge Use 10 face damage, of course. This is... I don't know. Depending what he gets now, I might be bone. No, it's not a depending anymore. He will kill me with the next turns. So let's see what we get with these cards at least. Lothab, Deathbring the Dragon Lord, that's pretty cool. But we are losing here. It appears that playing the legendary decks isn't really paying off because everyone plays early game cards. Which is quite boring, to be completely honest. But we're going to see if we can stir up some shenanigan deck let's see what we can get let's see murloc i got inspired by that murloc guy Gonna take Murloc Tiny Fin, of course. Tide Caller, and we're actually gonna toss him War Leader as well. Let's go. Probably a very stupid idea, but this is quite of a stupid thing, anyways. Oh god. Everything's gonna be countered by him using. Him using arcane missiles, god knows what, but this is a pretty solid start with the murlocs. They're very cute, of course. So, ideally, if we get another murloc tide caller, it would look the most optional for us here. Murloc war leader, okay, we're gonna save our coin for now. So cute. Look at them. So we're playing Mana Worm. Will he play Mirror Image, of course? Will he go for the clear? Oh, this means I might have a chance then. Let's do this, and then we're coin or more like a war leader here. So we've seen that he has two, the two cards he uses already we've seen. Mana Worm. Okay, Arcane Missiles, Mana Worm, and... Mirror Image, that's the name I was looking for. 
We seem to be off to a pretty good start here. And this is ridiculously good, to be completely honest. This is looking good for me. He doesn't have any immediate clears for my Murloc War Leader, so... He's just gonna have to try to get him off eventually. I don't think he'll have enough time to get them off before I win. I could hero power, but you know what? We want to have a clean Murloc game. We don't want no bearded silver hand recruits to join. And we won with the stupid Murloc deck. Apparently, aiming all the early game is what you win with this deck. And that will conclude our first look at the Tavern Brawl of this week. We had some good runs, we had some bad runs. Majority was bad runs, but it was fun nonetheless. So, I think I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye.